welcome to Falaraki Roads, 9pm, let's take a wee walk, um, we'll see what we can find, the title of the video might change depending on what I come across, and it might just be a wee random one, Falaraki at 9pm, who knows, I've not been past this bit at all so I've got no idea what's up here, some nice shops here actually, um, I'll definitely say that Falaraki at night visually is a lot nicer during the day, I wasn't really sure when I came here at first to walk down the strip, Obviously it's a bit quieter as well, um, but at night it seems to kind of come alive, even the strip's really bit, uh, busy as well. The one way supermarket over there, it's lovely wee restaurant here, what's this called? Aruba Cocktail Bar, sorry. Looks lovely in there, isn't it? Aruba Cocktail Bar, if you fancy a wee cocktail, you can go to Aruba. Maybe that would be the title, I went to Aruba. And they been to Aruba. It's a lovely place. It's another nice place over here as well. What's this called? Oh, look at this. A wee bonus the night train. <laughs> there you go. This place is bizarre. Look. Game of t-shirts and shirts. All sorts. Five euro, euros for shots. Oh, gonna say it yours. Can you go in there? <laughs> Right, let's continue, see what else we can find down here. Trilogica. Or is it Trilogy? Can't read it from here, my sight's so bad. Um, we kids family activities can arcade place. Quite a lot in here, so if you come in here as a family, here's a wee place that will probably interest you. They've got all the traditional games, the air hockey, basketball up at the back, pool table, uh, catching machines that are impossible to win. <laughs> yeah, right. I've, I've, how many people won the iPhone 14? All about fun, isn't it? You know, you know you're going to lose your money. Pac-Man's here. Look at that, it's cool. So, basketball round there. Yeah, okay. That's the family. Box tick I've showed you what you can get. Do for families. And for a racket. Let's continue. A few shops over there as well. Oh, look at this place. What's this place here? A few nice places. <laughs> Guys, wait me. Rise Cocktail and Restaurant Bar. Very, very nice, actually. What's the cocktails, viewers? I know you don't want to know that. Eight euros. Okay. Standard, really, for cocktails. Isn't it a bottle of beers? Quite pricey for the beers. Five euros for most of them. Beautiful bar inside. Very, very nice. I wonder if it gets really busy at night. It might. It might well do. It's nice. Um, it's still pretty hot, but it's got a bit windy. The temperature in Greece the last three days has been unbelievable. This place is bliss. Let's go over here and see this. There's a few places here as well. There's more than expected here. Down there, we'll see what's down there as well. The ice cream place doing crepes as well, lovely. Pancakes, nice. Okay, headline might be this was bliss. It might be, it might be yours. You never know unless I find something more catchy near the end. Um, a really nice little place as well in here. Let's check it out. Oh, just in queue, the music comes on, eh? Busy in here. All the way back as well, so it's kind of surprised me, Father Aki, a lot of these nice places. Just off the main kind of strip back. Very, very nice. Let's continue. Um, we'll see what's up here. We've got a fast food place, which is very busy over there, actually. What's it called? Star Fast Food, established 2002. Quite a lot of people on it. Oh, we outside. Right here. Now, I'm going to tell you, by the way, be very, very careful in Falaraki. See this? I mean, it's good for obviously mobility, for access, but you can be walking along the street, not paying attention, and all of a sudden, you just dip down a level. I don't know if you can see that in the camera of yours. But basically, the whole curb has dropped all the way along there, and quite a few times I've nearly fell. Now, to be fair, obviously, I'm looking at my camera, but if you're walking and looking ahead, you, you wouldn't notice this. You could easily fall. Maybe that will be the headline warning, be careful because I've nearly fell quite a few times. 
But here's another really nice place across here. It's going to come down here later on, but kind of glad I came at night because it's nicer at night. These places here look kind of a bit classier than the places in the strip, to be honest with you. I'm assuming when I was filming back there, that was the strip when I've done the other video. Don't know. I'm not going to go right over here, but because they've got very loud music, it's quite busy, I can see. They've all got this kind of wee jungle vibe, haven't they? It's nice, the trees and all that. Let's continue. The music is blaring. How inconsiderate. <laughs> What's the name of it? Uh, La Esquina. La Esquina restaurant. Okay, it looks lovely. We've got a wee waterfall feature at the back there. Don't know if you can see that. Beautiful. Nice. Right, let's continue. I've done it again, viewers. I went down a level. Look. Again, they've dropped a curb all the way down here. 100% be careful if you're walking here. If you're looking forward and not paying attention, you just suddenly drop a level. Right, more for families. There's a lot of family stuff here. Um, doesn't give me the vibe of a big family resort, but I suppose the strip that is a mix, but there's lots of nightclubs open to all hours. Some of the nightclubs don't open to midnight and they're open till 7 in the morning, I think. They basically say they're open till sunrise. So, it's a wee bit different, a wee happy smoke place over there as well. Let's continue a wee bit quicker about yours. We need to get away from the Bee Gees music over there, coming out a random shop. It's not a bar as well. Got a hotel coming up here, let's see where this hotel is. Okay. Glad to come up here now, there's more than expected. That's the hotel Apollo Beach in there. I'll tell you something, it's a beautiful entrance in there, all the way down. The lights are clashing with the camera, but beautiful. Bedrock over here. The Flintstones bar, eh? Yabba dabba do. Again, might be stuff for kind of families in here. I can hear music coming from somewhere. It's this place here. Well, again, the curb. It's dropped all the way down again. <laughs> so many times I keep doing this. Lovely little place in there as well. Pizza and cocktails. Linguine. Take the bedrock bar, looks nice. Let's check it out, viewers. Yeah, nice in there as well. A wee street market there. Food line street market. So there is the bedrock bar over there. Quite busy. A few people in. Goes all the way back. It's like a wee kind of cave, isn't it? Looks nice. Okay, now we're talking. Now we're talking, viewers. How can they do this? All inclusive. One hour, 15 euros. Two hours, 20 euros. And George's. That's going to attract surely a younger crowd. Generally, a beer's four or five euros in most of these bars here. So, I mean, if you're paying 20 euros for two hours, you drink, what, Five beers, you're in profit probably, roughly. So the spirits you save money on, but could have live music on as well. I can see the advertising. That looks like a really good bar actually. Let me cross over. Obviously, I'll not be doing the all inclusive. I've got entertainment or karaoke on. So here's the specials, but see, this is where I don't get it because they've got the all inclusive option, but they've also got two big beers for five euros. So two euros fifty for a beer, two vodka red bull, seven euros. It's pretty cheap, eh? Um, yeah, nice bar. Hello. Advertise some sport. Okay. It's nice in there. They were advertising the rugby earlier on. Stretches all the way back there. So if that's where you want to see your sports, it looks like a really good place. Some people will say it's simply the best. You can hear the, the music in the background. A couple of wee kids games stuff here as well. A uh, boxing machine which always indicates the young crowd will win there. Dance club next door, the MGM. We're not in Vegas, but quite a lot more for families in this wee strip than other places. Slush factory, that's heaven, isn't it, if you're a kid? Slush factory. So we've got the mini golf here and it's uh, floodlights, so don't worry. It's floodlights. We've got a wee moto centre over here for hiring bikes and stuff like that. We've got Sky Park Bowling in here as well, so we've also got. Ten pound bone, and we've got go karts. This is a, this is, I mean, it's a variety show. This one, you've seen everything, all inclusive bars, soft play areas, um, go karts. Hundred percent. You got a family. You're going to be in here. I would have been in here years ago when my, my girls 
definitely. Kids are loving the soft player. They've got other arcade games round at the back. They've also got uh, bowling and other stuff. Um, so it looks a really nice place actually for families. Let's continue, viewers. If there's much else up here, I don't know. Blair music coming from this place on the left hand side. So I'm going to decide if I'm going to walk up further or not. I don't know. I'm going to wait and see, viewers. Um, but that mood, the music's actually coming from the kids' place. I'm giving this place around, it's not them at all. The alcohol shop over there. I don't know how much there is down here, viewers. Texas style fried chicken place in there. Artisan grill place in here. Really nice wee place inside, isn't it? Yeah. A bar here that looks quite nice from the outside, I can see. I don't know if there's much more down here. I might continue down here, we'll make a decision, viewers. If you're new to the channel, do me a favour, hit the wee subscribe button, it's absolutely free, it doesn't cost a penny. Um, check out all the other videos on the channel, I'll leave a playlist. Here's one of the few places with live music here, starting at half past eight. They've got a Latin party, starting at nine. There you go, lovely bar. Look at that, nice eh? So that's called Moe Lounge Bar, very nice. Very nice. Uh, pity it's not busy, eh? Just beautiful bar. Guy sounds good on the guitar. Might stop for a wee drink there, we'll see yours. Live music, can't beat it. Can't beat it. First cut is the deepest, eh? I see you singing just now. This wee bar here. Oh, rent a Tony's bottle. I thought it was a bar, it's not. Part a bar here, art, music, and bar. So, possibly another place, place for buying music. Not sure. They've got happy hour on here as well. Big draft beer, four euros. Just noticed a really nice restaurant across here in my second year. Somebody shouting out the window of the car there, I don't know what's going on there. A wee Greek taverna here, what's it called? Etion. It was lovely. Let's check out this place over here, viewers. So that's self expansion, that's a tourist shop, summer ideas. Nice wee restaurant in here, isn't it? I don't know the name of it. Don't see any name on it. Oh, it's busy anyway. Very busy. I think there's some hotels and apartments down here towards the beach. So I can kind of see now why you know families maybe would come here. Apart from a few places, there's not that much going on for families, but you could argue the same. People always ask me, Terry, for oh, where's the best bars and all that for families? Now, there's not that many um, that are really geared up for families. There's a couple of places with soft play areas. Lovely in here, isn't it? A um, couple of places with soft play areas and 10 pin bowling. There's not that much going on. The place I've seen, I've been to that's most family orientated was Alcudia in Mallorca. I was in, I was in quite a few of the bars there, and at night they did mini discos and stuff like that. Um, it was just full of families, a lot of hotels, families as well. We don't need to go off the road yours. Pancho's Mexican bar there as well. There's another nice restaurant. What's this called? Castellan. Lovely. Greek salads and all sorts in there. I missed this one, Rattan. Premier League football in here. Oh, Mike's bar. Okay, Mike. Looks like a nice wee bar, cracking wee bar for the football. Very nice. All Premier League matches and a pint. It's three euros fifty. What is not to like, Bears? Okay, welcome cold beer here. That's always a good selling point, isn't it? There you go. Established 1981. It's been here a long time. Everybody will know this. If you come to Falaraki, you'll know this part. So there you go. It's your prices. Under four euros for all that stuff as well. Pints 350. They've got the big bottles of the local stuff, 390. Very affordable. Check out this wee place, it's nice. It's a wee Mexican place. Oh, nice inside, eh? Very nice. 
Let's have a look at the menu. Another random tourist shop in there. Heard somebody saying, let's look at the menu. I might be going for my second dinner soon. I've done a wee edited vlog, you'll see it on there, but I ordered a chicken wrap from the Jamaica bar. I didn't have my reading glasses with me, so I couldn't read the, the menu. I could just see it with a chicken wrap. And it came with one thing that I really don't like, viewers. Can you guess what it was? I know you are, I can't believe it, Kevin. Cheese. Oh, I'm not really... I'm not really into cheese at all. I can't eat it. So as soon as I took one bite, I was like, I had to leave it. So that dinner was kind of wasted. Had a few chips, that was about it. Okay, JD Friends Live Music Bar. Maybe the best to end here. Look at this wee cracking place here. The music club. Okay, so have they got live music or is it a DJ? I don't know. It's a nice wee bar anyway. Looks as if we've got another kids play bit over there as well. Okay, hold on. Food and coffee by Steve is down there. Look at this bar here, showing all the football as well. Sports Day Live. Okay, very busy with the bar. Okay, a lot of people in here. When is the, when's the live music coming on? Let's see when that's advertised. The live music bar, I think it's, yeah, it's part of the same bar, I was going to see that. We're all together, we've got a really cool bike in here, it's a nice bar inside. As if they got a car in there or some sort. Can you see it, yours? Um, got this cool bike up here. Cracking. Yeah, it looks nice. Very nice. At the back, you can see a bit of band kind of set up. I think they do, maybe do live music. I don't know why it's not advertised, but it's on. I might inquire, we'll see, viewers. I'm not, I'm not quite sure where I'm going to be going. That's Happy Land. I took you to Happy Land. I nearly fell down a, another uh, curb there, viewers. Okay, yeah. Proper live music bar. It's got the band set up, the drums and all that there. Which is it for a beer here? Let's have a wee look and see. It's draft. Uh, 4.50 and 5 euros. Again, not bad, considering you're going to get live music, entertainment, and you might be able to sit in a car as well. What a cool place. What a cool place. Right. I don't know if there's anything else to show you down here. Look at this wee bit here, but I've actually got cars and stuff in here. What's going on here? <laughs> Did not expect this. The most bizarre ending. Oh, I need to think of a title for this one, viewers. Look at all these cars in here. It's just like we kids, but like, play area, isn't it? They have got a wee bar as well, but I think you just bring your, your drinks through from the bar. Um, so, how interesting. Got the TV on as well. I did not expect that at all. Right, okay. I think that's us really at the end of the road. I don't think there's anywhere else I can go down here. It's not going to take me miles away because I'm going to have to walk all the way back up to my hotel. If you've watched to the end, you're an absolute superstar. I think we've seen a good variety in that walk there. You've seen a wee bit of what Falaraki's got to offer. Uh, some very nice restaurants. S some really quite good stuff for families. A couple of clothes shops. And then at the end... Okay. Um, you seen a few bars, some good bars as well. And then at the end, you seen a pub with cars in it. I mean, you can't complain about that, can you? There you go. Music bar restaurant by Smokey, Smokey Joe's. Oh, fell, fell again there. <laughs> Tried to move up because I could hear somebody behind me and then I just, oh, missed the curb a wee bit. Okay, catch you next one. Thanks for watching.